Now, one of the most uh, popular and uh, rewarding pastimes in rural Ireland, especially in the winter months, is the whole area of amateur dramatics. But here in the village of Kilrossenty in County Waterford, well, they've gone one step further. They've embraced the silver screen. Actually, they've been involved in film production for many years now. They're a group called uh, Bachelors in Trouble, and we recently joined them on the set of their latest production, which goes by the curious title, Tractor Tax and Station Jews. Is there anyone out there, out there? Is there anyone there at all? Who would come and live? Uh, we're filming uh, Bachelors in Trouble uh, 16 DVD, and uh, uh, the, the storyline is uh, the brothers, the bachelors, are, are being taken to court for no tax and insurance, the lot and the tractor. After anything at all uh, that has happened in the past, we'll come into it and uh, we're trying to get through as much as we can today. It's very cold, so... Uh... When we see you about this in court... Oh, Jack, oh, he's going to bring us to court. Hey, 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 hey now, Sergeant, hang on a minute now. Hey. Yes? yes. I have nothing to do with that now. I, I, that's their oh, tractor. The Bachelors in Trouble is a, we say a film series now going on for the last 20 years and it's based on two bachelors who live in rural Ireland and what they're trying to do is they're trying to get a wife for one. You see, Jack is the oldest fella and uh, he owns the land. He doesn't want a wife, but he, if he could get a wife for Tom, Tom's wife didn't have to do all the work. That's the... That's really what the bachelors are trying to do, is get a wife for Tom, so she'd have to do all the work. My character is Tom Coffey. I live with my brother Jack, and we live at home on a small little farm. We have ten cows, we have six calves, we have four donkeys, and we sleep, and we have eight hens, and one duck, and two cocks. And I sleep in the one bed with my brother Jack, and that's why we can't get a woman, you see, because if we got a woman, where would we put her? Now, I've been talking to the matchmaker and he's going to come over there to try and get you a woman. Now, I told him I don't need a woman because I've mad at home to do the jobs. I don't need any woman because I sleep with me brother Jack. What do I want a woman for? Well, the people involved in the Bachelors of Trouble are people who all live in this area. They're all locals who come in and do a part. Uh, but the main characters are Tom and Jack and Tommy Power, the neighbour, Katie the shop, Bridgie, uh, the Saturday Clancy courses, nearly in all of them. And uh, our, our cameraman, Willie, Willie, Willie Hattry, is the main cameraman editor. Oh, we're not going to extend anything out. Come on away, we have enough of that old woman talk. I would say the fun in my life um, comes from the makings of the Bachelor in Trouble uh, films. I, like, I would never meet Sean that much, only for this, and either with Tony and Liam and the whole gang there, uh, here, you know, and if, if, if I hadn't Bachelors in Trouble, I'd say there would be very little going on in my life as regards fun, crack and all that, because this is where it all comes from, and it helps to develop your character as well, in and out of film. Hello, Sergeant, how are you? Bridgie, how are you? I have them tarts made for you. Very good, they're very lovely. good. The grand fresh apples such a lovely good apples, aren't they? Oh, they were lovely. Yeah. And there's more where they are. Came they? From, oh, that's yeah. great. Were they windfalls? Why is he fun? No, not at all. The best is <clears> We all know one other with years and all great characters. You'd have a great bit of crack. And uh, the best part of it at times can be in between the, the out shots. Since we started in uh, 89, uh, We've uh, we've come a long way. Like it's it's been a great crack. It's it's a great group to work with, and and uh, we've been a lot of places. We've done a lot of good filming. It wasn't easy. We had some late nights, and and I hope it'll continue for a while yet. We're not finished yet. We have some more to do. Hello, Mickey. <laughs> Look, uh, we go back a long way, and I think I'm entitled to this deal. The local community, I suppose, uh, benefit from it because uh, as we're here today, we'll be shown nationwide on TV, nationwide are here today and we've been on the Late Late Show. So the parish of Kilrossand and the surrounding area has been shown to the national people all over the world, America, England and sure, it's not going to have to do us any harm, is it, in 20 years? Oh my God, uh, that's some deal uh, to get a woman for them, that's what it is. <laughs> County Waterford is a beautiful spot, beautiful. The mountain and the sea are near one another and there's lovely walks there on the mountain. There's beautiful beaches all along and a lot of this are in our films. And I think it really promotes it. I would say that um, people in the local community, I'd say they enjoy um, the success of 
uh, the DVDs of Bachelors in Trouble. I know from my own job, people come from all over, as well as, um, we'll say, the natives. Uh, they come in to say how well we've done and to know how much they enjoy it. Now, Jack, the weather has gone too bad. We'll have to put that fall in the house because she'll have perished below the bar. Yeah, this is amateur <laughs> dramatics on film. If we weren't doing this, we'd be on stage in Carrick on Shore or John Gareth. And, and although I'd much prefer this, it's more relaxed and and uh, we all enjoyed and we all have great fun together and we're all a big team and so we really enjoyed we all enjoyed and we all got on very well together uh, instead of you mind the donkeys we quit the woman could mind the donkeys come on bring in the well, I carry the fall all go on. Oh, good God, on. she's a lovely little fall she is go on bring her in come on come on we don't come up with any ideas because we never have a script we just mix it up in our head you know we went to school too we have a few brains you know but, but ideas you know we sit down and we sit around the fire and we get the ideas like you know we'll say here we'll go this way we'll go that way and we might chop it and do it again you know no bother on the world and selling because people are mad about the bachelors all over the world. They even show them in the pubs in America, you know, because that cult Irish feeling is there all the time. There's plenty of people like the simple, the Jackie Healy Rays of Ireland and the John B. Keynes of Ireland. People like that kind of stuff. The bachelors are double and we live by ourselves alone. Hey Jack! Well, what's next for the bachelors, we hope, is that we'll continue on. Next year is going to be our 20th anniversary, so that uh, we hope that we'll have a, something very special put, on, 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 put, put together for next year, that we can bring all the old characters back in and have one big hell of a, a bash. Oh yeah, and Jack, uh, do you think the song will get a woman for us? And if you'd like to get some of those movies, uh, you can order them from the uh, website address, which is on your screen right now. That ends our programme for this evening. Do join us again at the same time on Friday next. Until then, from Kilrossenty and County Waterford, from all of us in the Nationwide team, a very good evening to you. And on the